guys, how's it going? Just before the video gets started, I wanted to let you know that I have just released a brand new song. I'll pop a link in the description below. I'm really keen to hear what you guys think of it. Let me know. Today, I'm gonna try and prank Kate by telling her that I am joining the army. Now, I've been seeing this idea pop up a lot on my Twitter. You guys have been asking me to try and pull this prank. So I thought, hey, I'm gonna try and give it a go. So make sure you guys give this video a huge like if you like it when I roll with your ideas and if you want me to roll with more ideas in the future. Now when I started thinking of this idea, I thought that there was no way in hell Kate would believe me if I told her that I was joining the army. So then I started thinking, I should tell her that I'm joining the army as a pharmaceuticals officer since I am a pharmacist. Now this is an actual role in the army. It's the person who orders all the medications, which is obviously very important. So what I've organized is when Kate gets here, I'm gonna tell her that I just got an offer letter from the Australian Defence Force because I sent in an application a couple of weeks ago. I'm gonna have to try and convince her that this is something that I've always wanted to do. I'm gonna have to act really excited. I've literally prepared a legit offer letter that I'm gonna show her and hopefully I can convince her and get a great reaction from her. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Katie! What? Come here! Oh my gosh! Katie, come here! Come here! What? I just got an offer to be a pharmacist in the Defence Force. What? In the Army! I'm gonna be a pharmacist in the Army! Come here! Look! Dear Mr. Ackle, letter of offer to Mr. Slayman Ackle, thank you for your recent application for the position of pharmaceutical officer in the ADF, Australian Defence Force. We are pleased to offer you this full-time position. This is a two-year minimum position where you'll be stationed at various locations as part of a segment within the ADF. Oh my gosh! Why do you have that? I'm in shock. I'm actually in shock right now. Whoa! How do you have an office, Simon? Secretary, Air Chief Marshal, Chief of the Australian... Oh my gosh, this is so crazy. Did I tell you about the application? I didn't, I'm sorry. It was like two weeks ago, right? They had all their healthcare positions open up and I got an email about it. And so I was like, hey, I should just fill out an application. I'm not gonna lie, I think my application sucked. I, I actually didn't even think I would get anything back. I had to fill in all the stuff about my previous experience and stuff and I like, I did it so quickly and then I just got that then in the, in my email. To be a pharmacist in the army. What? Oh my god, I'm like freaking out. So are you sure? Yes! Are you serious? Well, let's read the, the letter that says offer, letter of offer. Why did you apply for that? We are pleased to offer you this full-time position. Why did you apply for that? Because it's such an awesome job. I get to be in the defense force as a pharmacist. Like, how cool is that? It beats working in a community pharmacy or a hospital pharmacy. And I mean, I haven't really started my whole law career, so I didn't think anything of that. Obviously, I can do that later on in life. But since I've been working as a pharmacist, I've got experience. And that was like, I don't know. I just thought like, hey, I should just try and do this. I actually didn't think I was gonna get anything from it. I really didn't. I was like, yeah, I'm wasting my time filling this application. What am I doing? My heart, feel my heart, my gosh. What? Be happy! That's so random. Oh my gosh, why did you even like apply for that? What do you mean why did I apply for that? Like, I don't know, it seems so weird. You think I'm joking, don't you? Kind of. Read it, you're okay. I'm not joking. I'm I'm in as much shock as you to be honest. <laughs> Woohoo! Okay, why are you so excited? I didn't even Because know this is like a dream job of mine. Really? I remember ever since pharmacy school they had it we had a talk from the defense force like in our final year and I thought hey that would be so cool. The pharmacist is like the person in charge of all the medications and everything and obviously everyone's getting injured and sick and stuff in the army. It's such an important role. And to have that as experience in my life is like incredible. And like, I got the freaking job. 
I get to be in the army. I wonder if they like get to train me and stuff, like just in like combat and like obviously not like the same way as a soldier, but I think everyone has to undergo some sort of physical training. I have no idea. You actually like want to do it? Yes! I'm gonna go get us some food. I wanna celebrate. This is crazy. Oh my gosh, Kay. I, I'm like in shock. I'm shaking. Why didn't you tell me that you applied for it? I'm sorry. I, I literally, I, I applied. I just then thought there was nothing gonna come from it. I thought there is no way in hell I'm gonna get this job. And so I just, it just like left my mind. I didn't even think of it. Anyway, I'm gonna get it. Do you wanna, what do you want? KFC or McDonald's? I'll feed you back. Hey guys, so I've just popped out for a bit. Now what I've organized is, I've got legit army clothing, like legit army clothing that I'm gonna come back home with and I'm gonna tell Kate that I went into an army supply store because I'm so excited about everything and I'm gonna use this to really, really convince her that I am actually joining the army. So, when I was getting in the car, I started reading through all the introductory things um, and we all have to wear this uniform for the first week, which is so cool because it's like proper like army clothing, which is, I didn't think I was actually going to get to wear this stuff, but they have an army supply store, so I went to go get it, that's why I was a bit long. Just then, just like then. Oh, I forgot the food. Ah, oh, we'll just go out. Anyway, I'm so excited! So I got the pants, and then they gave us a shirt. And it's got like the Australian flag on it, how cool is that? So this must be like, I don't know, I don't know. I was just like, what? How cool? Ah! Why did you just go and get that just then? Because I'm excited, Katie. The pants feel very heavy though. But like you haven't like decided, have you? What do you mean? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I just called my mom and everything. She was so happy as well. She was like even more excited than me. She was like, oh, my son's gonna be in the army. What the hell? I wanna try these on actually. I wanna see how they look. All right, how do I look? I feel like the pants are a bit big, but I've got these like weird pocket things. So. Obviously I won't be wearing these shoes though. You should take a picture. I want to post this. This is so cool. Oh my gosh. It's such like a weird feeling. Where is my phone? Did you, have you seen my phone? Katie. Hey. Hey. What? Hey. 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 What's going on? I don't want you to go. <laughs> Katie. Hey. Stop. Stop. You, why are you crying? <laughs> What do you mean? I want you to stay here with me. Oh my gosh. Okay, Katie, I'm just joking. I'm sorry. I'm joking. I'm not going anywhere. Hey, stop. Stop. I'm just joking. I'm joking. It's a joke. Stop. I'm. Hey, it's a joke. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. I'm just joking with you. I'm not going to the oh, I'm sorry. Oh, uh, sorry, stop. No, don't cry. I've got a camera and everything set up. I'm just, oh, shit. Hey, 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 hey. Stop, it's just a joke. I made that letter. I photoshopped that letter all together. It's just a joke. Anyone can buy these clothes. It's just from an army supply store. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize you'd get upset like this. Oh my gosh. So, dude, stop. Take it easy. It's fine. I'm so sorry. Can I, oh, let me show you the camera. I'm sorry. Just, look. Can you please Okay, yeah, yeah, stop. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's just all a joke. Oh my gosh. You got so upset. I don't want you to I'm not going stop. anywhere. I wouldn't last a day, Kate. You know me. You meant to stay here with me forever. I am. I'm just going to turn this off. I've never been before.